already this was uncomfortable, and Stanley decided that as soon as he found a new space he felt safe in, that he would never leave it again in his life. Ah, so it just follows on from the previous ending. That! Stanley came it was to the, the correct way. Open this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. The lounge was sublime, a work of art. But eager to get back to business, so I will. Stanley took the first. I'm trying to follow him as left. many of the paths as possible. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, Whoa. walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Damn, it does actually put you back on track. Yet wow. There was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping I'm he might speak. find an answer there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. 2845. Okay, I think we all know the drill by now. Blah, blah, blah. Dark secrets, the keypad. Stanley pushes some buttons. Oh, hey, look, it's a new passageway. Kill surprise. It's like the game learns. Like, literally. It, like the first time I went in the broom closet, it was like, okay, you're in the broom closet. The second time, it was like, again? And the third time, it just blocked it off. Stanley walked straight ahead I'm gonna through kill the myself. door that read Mind Control Facility. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this violent hall, death. Stanley would meet his violent death. Stay long hallway. The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. At this point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront uh. his death. Hello, violent death! Well, we both knew it was going to happen. Ah! As the machine whirred into motion and Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise, he reflected that his life had been of no consequence whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. Farewell, Stanley. Uh-oh. What? Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. The fuck? The fuck? A narrator narrating the narrator? And yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game what? back in his office as alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? What? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? 
Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Obviously, uh, this blueprint throws you off from the beginning of the game. Part of Stanley's office is two doors. First part of the game built. Sections have been added and altered throughout the development, throughout the core layer systems, like almost identical to the original. Corridor. The pacing of this opening session was important to get right. Corridor has been moved and altered to make sure the player reaches the two doors in a good time. The two doors. The section of two doors was the very first concrete piece of the Stanley Parables design. Once this room was created, the rest of the game emerged as an extension of it. An exploration of the conduction this room posed. Filing cabinets. Office computers. Hey, it's Solitaire! Ah. Not anymore. Credits! I thought they did something. Is this literally the credits? Maintenance room? The photocopier! Warzone? Ah. Uh. So that was never a thing. No way to emails. Nothing. The office. So, it's actually very interesting to see, like, the development stuff. Zending levels. Zending. Damn. Does ending more made the full version of the ending was concrete complete? What's this? Exit the Stanley Parable. <laughs> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control Off. one another. How they both wish to be free. Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? No, perhaps not. Sometimes these time. things cannot be seen. But listen to me. You can still save these two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat this. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now, and it'll be your only true choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let time... I don't think quitting would have done much. It wouldn't. I'm just going to restart all over again. Isn't it? Isn't it? Well, 
Right. Let's... Hmm. What have I... I haven't tried obeying him with the lift. You know, I jumped off the lift. 